I'm here at Kyunggi Startup Summit and we're with knowhow.zip to learn all about their new service. Hi, how are you today? Hi, my name is Sue Min from knowhow.zip and our company is making an AI document translator. An AI document translator? I've seen AI translators a lot now. What makes your service unique compared to other services? The most unique thing about our service is that it's very simple and it's usable, it's really simple and um, you can really easy, easily use it. So the first thing is that when you drag your file or the link of the website like Notion or um, Docs, Google Docs, mm -hmm. you can translate it immediately. And the second thing is that you can translate into multi languages at the same time. So if you just drag in English, it makes into Korean or Spanish at the same time. At the same time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you when you say click it. When you say multi, I'm reading your pamphlet right now, 60 plus languages, not yes. just one, two, or maybe five, sixty at the same time. Yes, it's right. Wow. So other services you have to drag and drop and then you can only translate the texts. Okay. And our service, if you just drag in the file or the link, you can translate into multi-languages at the same time. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I'm seeing some other stuff. I've used the other programs before like ChatGTP or Papago or Google Translate. Yes, yes. But the text always kind of comes out either underneath or to the side in a way that it's kind of hard to tell where each thing is. Mm -hmm. Another option I see is scrolling in sync. Yes, this option is making the translation more useful because you can compare with other languages. So um, the sync is right when you're scrolling. So English and Korean, if you scroll it, the sync is going to be... Um, At the same time, it kind of like it compares exactly kind of what words and sentences and the grammar structure being used. So you can like address each problem to make sure that the translation is correct. Yes, yes, that's the function that we are providing. Very cool. And then I see the three at the bottom too, editing, uh, sharing, and industry glossary. I understand the editing. Can you explain these two just a little bit more? Yes, so we can share the files into other, uh, we can share the files to other people, but it's in the same document as this. So we prov um, when we share it, you don't share the, just the text, but we share the original file um, to to other people but are they looking at it on the same language or can they look at the same file all in different languages at the same time so uh, so like when, when you share it say mm -hmm. I, I'm an American you're Korean yes. if I want to look at the same document at the same time mm -hmm. can I look at it in English while you look at it in Korean so when I share it with the Spanish language, uh -huh. you can see in Spanish. Ah. And when we share it in Spanish and German uh -huh. together, then you can see both. See both, very yes. cool. Yes. And then the last one, it's a short interview. I don't mean to take up too much of your time, but this last one is really interesting. What's industry glossary AI? Yeah, this is a very interesting function in our service. So we provide um, each of the vocabularies for it each industry so when you click business you can see um, most used business vocabularies and this is in this is um, provided in the translation wonderful I think you did a great job explaining I, I as I said being a foreigner living here in Korea and you being Korean speaking multiple languages as well we've yes. probably used a lot of translation services before yes. And with AI kind of taking over now, uh, it kind of seems like there's a lot in the market right now. It's a little saturated, but looking at yours, there are still so many options that we can address. The multiple language, the glossary, this is really cool. And your company is knowhow.zip. Yes. What is the name of this product? Our service is docs2.ai. You can search it up in Google. There you go, really simple, docs2.ai. Yes. Suman, thank you so much for your time today. Thank you. Appreciate it.